Have you ever wondered what makes Facebook tick behind the scenes? In this video, we are going to unravel Facebook's tech stack. Think of this as a backstage tour of one of the largest social networks on the planet. We'll break down the complex layers of technology that keeps your newsfeed buzzing and insights that are easier to digest than your daily scroll. Let's get started. Welcome to Facebook. Facebook operates on a robust infrastructure. It primarily relies on its custom-built data centers. These facilities are designed to optimize energy consumption and at the same time provide high availability and scalability. By leveraging the Open Compute project, Facebook develops its own hardware, which ensures efficiency in handling billions of user interactions daily. This is Facebook's way of keeping posts, photos, and videos at your fingertips without any delay. When it comes to programming languages, Facebook uses Hack for backend development, which adds static typing to PHP. This helps developers to catch the errors early. For the performance critical components, C is the go to choice. This provides the speed and efficiency that's necessary for Facebook's vast operations. And of course, JavaScript powers the front end, delivering dynamic web applications that engage millions of users every day. It's the perfect combo for a seamless user experience. For mobiles, Facebook utilizes React Native a framework that allows them to build applications for both iOS and Android using a single code base. This approach enables Facebook to deliver a consistent user experience across both platforms while maintaining high performance. Facebook's web platform is fueled by React along with HTML5 and CSS. React's component-based architecture allows for dynamic interface with fast load times and personalized content. CSS, on the other hand, helps create responsive designs that look great on any device. It's all about ensuring that your timeline flows smoothly, whether you're on a desktop or scrolling on your phone. For client-server interaction, Facebook relies heavily on GraphQL and REST APIs. GraphQL allows clients to request exactly the data they need, reducing overfetching and improving performance. It's like ordering only the specific toppings you want on your pizza. In contrast, REST is like a buffet where you take everything available. While it gives you a variety of options, you might end up with more food than you really wanted which might also lead to overfetching and less efficient performance. Facebook employs a microservices architecture in which the services are written in different programming languages. Thrift is used to facilitate communication between them. This ensures each service can operate independently while collaborating effectively. It's like a well-coordinated team with each member playing their unique role to keep Facebook running smoothly. Now, when it comes to real-time updates, Facebook utilizes WebSockets. This technology establishes a persistent connection between the client and the server, which allows for instant notifications and live feeds without frequent reconnections. Because no one likes waiting for updates, right? WebSockets ensure you're always in the loop. And to manage data efficiently, Facebook uses Memcached for distributed caching, speeding up access to frequently requested data. Alongside it, TAO serves as geographically distributed data store for Facebook's social graph ensuring low latency access to user data. Together, they keep your interactions fast and responsive. Facebook also handles massive amounts of data using a combination of MySQL and Cassandra. MySQL manages structured data and transactional needs, while Cassandra provides high availability and scalability for distributed storage. It's like having the best of both worlds to ensure your data is always safe and accessible. Big data plays a crucial role in Facebook's operations. They use Apache Hadoop for batch processing and Apache Spark for real-time analytics. This allows Facebook to analyze vast datasets quickly, delivering insights that drive user engagement and feature development. Think of this as Facebook's secret sauce for understanding your preferences. When it comes to machine learning, Facebook leverages PyTorch, an open source framework that facilitates building and deploying machine learning models. FB Learner Flow streamlines the ML workflow, automating training and monitoring. This powerful combo enables Facebook to enhance user experience with personalized recommendations and smarter interactions. Facebook has also built its own content delivery network to deliver content globally with minimal latency. By caching content closer to the users, Facebook ensures fast load times for photos, videos, and posts. For monitoring and analytics, Facebook employs Scuba for real-time data analysis and Scribe for log collection. These tools provide insights into system performance and user activity. 
which ensures everything runs smoothly and efficiently. It's like having a dedicated team to keep track of everything happening on the platform. In the realm of DevOps, Facebook uses Fabricator for code review and project management. Jenkins is for continuous integration and Chef is for configuration management. All of these tools streamline the development process, allowing Facebook to deploy new features quickly and reliably. It's all about keeping the engine running smoothly behind the scenes. When it comes to testing, Facebook relies on Jest for JavaScript testing and OS Query for system monitoring. Combined together, they help maintain the quality and reliability of the platform. And let's not forget about Chaos Monkey, Facebook's tool for resilience testing. It intentionally disrupts services to test system recovery, ensuring that even in the face of failure, Facebook remains reliable. It's just like a fire drill for their systems, always prepared for the unexpected. And there you have it, a streamlined look at Facebook's tech stack from its custom hardware to real-time data processing and everything in between. Understanding this infrastructure helps us appreciate the seamless experience we get on the platform. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell for more tech stack deep dives.